Have you ever wondered what makes SAP Fury so different from the traditional SAP GUI? Is it just a prettier interface or is there more to it? Stick around because in this video, we are breaking down the key differences between SAP Fury and SAP GUI and why it matters for your business. Hi everyone, welcome back to our channel Zaran Tech where we simplify complex tech topics. Today, we are diving into SAP Fury and SAP GUI the two main interfaces for interacting with SAP systems. While both are powerful tools, they serve very different purposes and offer unique experiences. By the end of this video, you will understand which one is better suited for your needs or if you need both. Let us get started. Let us start with a quick overview. SAP GUI or Graphical User Interface has been around for decades. It is a traditional interface used by all power users to access all SAP functionalities. Think of it as the workhorse of SAP systems. Functional, but not exactly user-friendly. SAP Fury, on the other hand, is the modern, mobile-friendly interface introduced in 2030. It is designed to provide a consumer-grade user experience with intuitive navigation and role-based apps. While both interfaces let you interact with SAP systems, their design philosophies couldn't be more different. Now, let us break down the key differences between these two interfaces. When it comes to user experience, SAP GUI has a text-heavy menu-driven interface that can feel overwhelming for new users. It is great for power users who know their way around transaction codes, but not ideal for casual users. SAP Fury, however, offers a clean, role-based design tailored to specific tasks. It is intuitive and feels like using a modern app. For accessibility, SAP GUI is desktop-centric and requires software installation. It doesn't work well on mobile devices. Fury is web-based and works seamlessly across desktop, tablet, and smartphones. Perfect for users on the go. When it comes to customization, Fury takes customization to the next level. You can personalize your launchpad, workflows, and even create custom apps. GUI offers limited customization. It is functional, but rigid. Performance-wise, Fury leverages modern web technologies for faster response times and smoother navigation. GUI can feel slower, especially when dealing with large data sets or complex transactions. For training, GUI has a steep learning curve due to its complexity. Fury's intuitive design reduces training time significantly. It is easier to pick up even for new users. So, where does each interface shine? SAP GUI is still preferred by technical users like consultants or developers who need access to all transactions and functionalities. For example, configuring system settings or running complex reports is easier here. Fury, on the other hand, is ideal for business users like HR staff or sales team who need quick access to specific tasks like approving leave requests or tracking sales orders. So, which one should you choose? If you're looking for speed, simplicity and mobility, go with Fury. It is perfect for modern businesses that prioritize user experience. But if you are a technical user who needs full access to all SAP functionalities, stick with GUI. And remember, you don't have to choose just one. Many organizations use both interfaces depending on their needs. So there you have it, the ultimate comparison between SAP Fury and SAP GUI. Both are powerful tools that serve different purposes within the SAP ecosystem. If this video helped you understand their differences, give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to Zaren Tech for more such tech insights. Thanks for watching. See you in the next video.